The Dallas Stars entered the 2016-17 season as one of the top contenders to win the Stanley Cup, listed with odds of 10 to 1. Dallas finished last season with a top record in the Western Conference and the second best record in the NHL. Dallas scored a lot of goals as they averaged 3.2 goals per game to lead the NHL, but they also allowed a lot of goals, allowing 2.8 per game, which was 20th in the league. The Dallas Stars had an overall record of 50-23-7-2 and the team was very good both at home and on the road. The Stars are all about offense as they led the league in goals scored a year ago with 267. They had three players score at least 33 goals in Jamie Benn, 41, Tyler Sagan, 33, and Jason Spezza, 33. The problem for Dallas is their defense and goaltending. The Stars allowed 230 goals last season, the most of any team that made the playoffs. Dallas should look a lot like they did a year ago as they try and win high-scoring games on a nightly basis. They were able to do that a lot last season, but it may not be as easy in 2016 and 17 as the defense actually looks weaker. And keep in mind that the Stars had to rally to win a lot of games last season, and it is never easy to keep coming from behind to win games. The offense is super with players like Tyler Sagan, Jamie Benn, Patrick Sharp, and Jason Spezza. But there are lots of questions on defense and in goal. It is hard to see how they will be any better as gone is Chris Russell, Alex Goligoski, and Jason Demers. The Stars did add Dam Hamuse, but he isn't going to replace three players. He may not even be as good as any of the three that are gone. Chris Russell was very solid on defense, and Alex Goligoski was probably the best two-way defenseman on the team. Dallas didn't do anything to address their issue in goal as they are sticking with Kari Lettinen and Antti Niemi, who simply were below average goaltenders last season. Dallas is going to be a fun team to watch again in 2016 and 17, but it is hard to see how they match last year's success. The Stars will score a lot of goals again, but they are probably going to be worse on defense than they were a year ago. That should mean a lot of high-scoring games, so the best option with Dallas in 2016 and 17 should be to bet their games over the total. The Stars will likely still make the playoffs, but they don't look like a team that will win the Central Division or do any serious damage in the playoffs. Don't forget that Bang the Book is your best resource for sports betting information on this event and every other sporting event and game this week. Click over to bangthebook.com now.